Field of eighth race pacers, three-year-old pacing Colts moving up behind the gates. On the inside, it'll be Daylon Alert with aces up. In the center, Quality Western, Radar Sun and Sirlock to the outside, Quarter Carrot, Jimmy Crack Cohen and Sin Shanover. A field of eights for the eighth cup elimination number one. They're at the top of the stretch. Here they come. Field for the first elimination is nearing the start. And they're off. It is Radar Sun in Randy Waples. First to fire. Aces up is driving well. Quality Western is third and angled over as they race into the first turn. That's Daylon Alert who's fourth. And making a break in stride. Radar Sun after making the front. Now Aces up has the ace position as they start on down the back stretch. And Quality Western now is up to second. That's Daylon Alert who's come away third. Then racing fourth is Sir Luck. Back in fifth is Quarter Carrot in front of Jimmy Crack Cohen and then since Hanover is seventh and out of this one is Radar Sign 28 seconds flat was the opening quarter and now with the lead that is Quality Western to move to the front Ace is up is going to sit in the pocket position and Dale on alert is racing third as the field comes off the turn quarter Carrot now is first up and challenging it on the inside that is Sir Luck also on the outside, that is Sin Shanover, and back on the inside is Jimmy Crack Cohen. And Jimmy Crack Cohen uh, making a break in stride there. 58 seconds flat was the halftime, and it is Quality Western and Ron Pierce with a lead of a length and a quarter. But here comes Quarter Carrot digging on the outside. Quarter Carrot is closing a bit, is a length and a quarter back. On the inside, that is Ace is up, who's getting a good trip in this dash, and Sin Shanover has moved up to fourth. Now Jimmy Crack Cohen on the outside. On the inside, Dale on alert. And then it is back to Sirlock, who is seventh one. Swanee, seven and one for three quarters. And Quality Western is getting a firm test from Quarter Carrot. And now Pace is on. Quality Western turns back that challenge. And Ace is up on the inside now. His second is Quarter Carrot's going to try to stay into the top four as they come on down the lane. Quality Western, Ace is up and coming again is quarter carrot but it's going to be quality western to take the eighth race the first cup elimination then finishing a second that was quarter carrot third was aces up and it looked like sir luck callers fourth 155 and two in the eighth cup elimination number one going to quality western and ron pierce Hey, Ronnie, uh, just tell us about the uh, trip there. Good things got going in that going to half of 58, pretty strong coming home, was he? Yeah, geez, he had plenty of pace. Um, things worked out real good for him. We got to the lead pretty cheap and um, got a good breather. I just sat there and chased him a little bit on the end of it. No problem getting around the half mile track. Some people said that may be a problem for him. Yeah, we thought it might be, but uh, the way uh, Blair has him rigged up here, it wasn't a problem at all. Okay, so nice and fresh for the final? I think so. Yeah, I think he's going to be better that second heat. Okay, Ronnie, way to go. Thanks. The eighth race now official. Back in front of us, there is a look at number three, Quality Western. Cup elimination number one winner. Three-year-old Western Hanover Colt, owned by Brittany Farms, along with Robert Burgess and Karen Olson Burgess and Robert Dickinson. Blair Burgess, the trainer. Ron Pierce, the winning tribe. Seventh of lifetime. Seventh this year, Quality Western, 155 and 2 to take Confederation Cup number 27, elimination number one in the eighth race. And on track side to make the cooler presentation representing JTI McDonald, we have Tamara Cox, Samantha Booker, also Chris Sterensick, James Hill, Jeff Shaver, and Kendra Esty, also Jim Burgoyne and Melissa Bauer. Eighth race mutual prices, three quality Western, 360, 250, and 210. 